So, you've bought a shipping label on PirateShip.com. Time to click that giant green Print Label button. At the top of the pop-up, select the label format you need for your printer. Once you've selected the label format, PirateShip will generate a label preview below, as long as you're using a web browser that supports it, like Google Chrome. We recommend using Chrome because it supports inline PDFs, which will simplify printing your labels. In Chrome, when you put your cursor over the label preview, there's this little print button at the top right. As you can see, clicking it opens a printing dialog box without having to download the file. In Firefox and in Edge, you can see the browser does not support inline PDFs. In Edge, just click the Open Labels in New Tab button. And in Firefox, right-click on the Download PDF link and select Open Link in New Tab. The PDF file will open in a new tab, and at the top right of each browser, click the printer icon. So here are the printing dialog boxes from Chrome, Firefox, and Windows Edge. The options are arranged a little different, but they all have the same basic options. First, make sure the printer you want to use is selected. In Firefox, click the Properties button. In Edge, you can select Let the app change my printing preferences. This should auto-configure the format for your printer. But for the sake of this example, we'll unclick it to show you the settings we need. Make sure the orientation is set to Portrait. In Chrome, orientation is always automatic. It's also important to make sure we have the correct paper size. In Chrome and Edge, click More Settings, and in Firefox, click Advanced. Next, make sure your paper size is the same as the format you chose on Pirate Ship. In certain cases, Fit to Page may be useful to make sure your label fits on the page. That should be it. Click Print, and in Firefox, click OK, and your label should print as expected.